Welcome back everybody to a, we're going to do a hunt here at Target and we're doing this on New Year's Eve. I'm using the new the new mic that I got for Christmas so we'll see how the audio works as well. Let's check out what they have inside. Okay so we're making our way to the aisle. Little end cap here. We have a Christmas Star Wars trooper still hanging out there. Mandalorian I mean. Back and going at the bottom, empty shelves, stretchies. Legends are pretty wiped. She Hulk. Here we have a Black Panther. We have the bigger Wakanda. There's that Spider Man guitar. We have some mech strikes on the shelf, page puncher. There's the atom. Got the cold, no heat wave. We have a Batrocitus here. Two of them. Future states. A bunch of Wonder Women here. They look like they just stocked up on a bunch of G.I. Joes. Looks like they are all the Cobra Vipers on this peg. A bunch of bats on this peg. And here we have more G.I. Joe bat troopers there. We have some Power Rangers here. I think, uh, oh, $13 clearance here. Not too bad of a price. Yellow Ranger. I wonder if she's on clearance too. And they have more G.I. Joe Outback. Along with some Lady J. And some more empty shelves here. Check out Jurassic Park little bit down in stock one empty peg the bigger ones here over into buzz light here we have some masters here beast man and mandalorian's grogu Still have some avatars. Star Wars squadrons here. We have a lot of Hordak and King Grey Skull. Hordak's on clearance, sixteen dollars, almost seventeen, and so is Shira. Not too bad of a price for those guys. We have a Vader helmet. And a little bit of Star Wars. Some pegs are empty. I didn't even see this guy. He's on clearance. Lando is eleven forty nine. And we have some wrestling here. I don't see any clearance stickers on these guys. Truck cage make our way to the uh, NECA spot. So we're here at the NECA spot, collector spot, whichever you'd like to call it. We'll start at the top with some Candyman. Oh, we have some Child's Play. Two of them. I don't see those very often at all. Rogu, Batman, black and white Batman. All the same. Some golds. Here are those awesome looking Star Wars pops. I really do enjoy their paint. Turtles box. TMNT Stranger Things. We have a Thor. An American Werewolf in London. You no, know, I'm a huge fan of werewolves, so 
but it is just so cool that you can pretty much get four figures out of one. Slash is in the house. Nice paint, good artwork. Looking good. Garfield is hiding some Toonie Terrors. There's the Jaws Toonie Terror there. Here's some more Renee. Or Renette. Some more Stranger Things and TMNTs. We have E.T. Evil Dead. Hera. Big old spider. Here we have a lonely little Star Wars Han Solo. We have April O'Neil as the bride. We have a Warrior Predator and the Battle Damage. American Werewolf in London. Werewolf here. Again. I get that reflection out of the way. I do love werewolves, but... I don't know. I want to get them, but the budget. Gotta save the budget for the Predators. We have some cloth they live here. With some pots. Limited edition Loki. Boastful Loki. Wondrous convention it says. Shuri. Lothar there. What is this? Oh, those are some tiny Power Rangers. That's cool. Stand them up here. We have a Laser Shot Predator. Nightmare on Elm Street 2. Michael Myers there in the back. I like the cover of the Michael Myers. And uh, part 3 of Freddy. This is the one that I have. This is the one that I like. I thought he had the, the better look. And I also like the way the you can replace the chest and he has the souls. Another Predator Emissary. Mummy accessory set here. We have Halloween 2. Michael Myers. I got the two pack with Loomis and where Michael is on fire. Frankenstein with aliens in the back. We have a Ronin here. This one's the armored one. I think I found the uh, previous one, the uh, unarmored at Walmart. Alpha Predator, Puppet Master, and E.T. and Wolfman. They have a creep show thrown off to the side. I think that does it for this location. Let's make our way to the next and see if they have better stock. We are at another Target here in North Austin. We're going to check out if they have anything better than what we have been seeing. Let's go inside and find out. Make our first stop here in the collectible NECA aisle. Kind of a little empty. But I'll show you guys everything that it has on the shelf. We have some of the same TMNT and Stranger Things mix up. Puppet Master. We have some blind bag here. We have an alien there. And we have more of the G.I. Joe bat. We have a Van Helsing Splinter. Okay. Some E.T. in the back there. A lot of Coraline dolls. And we Looks like we have the Hocus Pocus here. Looks like they have them all too. Who are they missing? Just the heroes, right? Move on over here. Looks like a Toonie Terror either fell apart or got stolen. Friday the 13th. Jaws. Flash Gordons side by side there. We have a Frankie. He's falling off the card back there. We have all three monsters here. 
some stents for some head sculpts, another ET. Look, we have The Last of Us. I like this dual pack. But it's a little bit too pricey for my budget, at least right now. But it does look good, and it comes with a bunch of accessories, too. Accessories can be used across all lines, I feel. Take a look at the back. That's a good one there. Take a look down here. We have the Warrior Predator, Demona in the back, the Alpha, with some aliens in the back. I wonder if the Warrior is just at Target and the Shaman is just at Walmart because I haven't seen either one in different locations. Frankenstein, more ET, a lot more ET, widely accessible. More predators here. Kong in the back there. And two of the Raph Frankenstein. More Toonie Terror. London Werewolf. Some surprise packs here. Flip. We have Flashpoint. Flash. Page Punchers there. And the Batman Flashpoint Page Puncher too. Let's go check out the other aisle. Start off here at an end cap. On the way to the aisle, a bunch of beast men. We have She Hulk, Miss Marvel, Shazam, Black Adam. I don't know why it says <laughs> he says Shazam too. Bat here, Kate Bishop, some Jurassic Park minis, and the dinosaurs. We have a three pack here and some Star Wars here. Okay, we'll continue down the aisle. We have some Beyblade on clearance, and it looks like they're clearing those pegs out. Down here is pretty much cleared out, too. Look at that, they have the Batman here. Got these guys for cheap online. Loved it. Like those figures. They got a lot of detail on them. Good job, McFarland. Have some legends here. Some empty pegs here. A couple more legends. We have some stretchy guys. Play along Black Panther. Looks like we got baseball mixed in. G.I. Joe here in the mix. Let's see, we have. Who is this? It's a Mott. Oh, that's strange. Aren't the different numbers usually the different figures? Oh, that's right. These guys are the twins. It's a Mott and Tomax. I forgot about that. Sergeant Stalker here in the back. And that's a Cobra Viper on the very far back. What's this here? These are from the movie, G.I. Joe. We have some Black Adam Page Puncher. I like his lightning effects. We have some wrestling mixed in at the bottom there. Let's move on up to some... Uh, Multiverse. We got the Batrocitus. I still need to review them. I have them. I need to review them for you guys. Try and get that up. Oh, clearance. That's a cool buy there. Okay. Three pack. I like the way the, the Superman looks. What else do they have? Martian Manhunter, Ocean Masters, Power Ring. I think he should be on clearance, but I'm not sure. I'll check that out and let you guys know. Future State Batman. It says $13.99 McFarlane figures. If that's 
legit. I may pick some up. We have some Power Rangers here. That pink, the pink Rangers on clearance. I don't think the red or the yellow ranger are. But I'll scan those if anybody's interested, just to cover everything. We have another Last of Us here. And here we have some Jurassic Park. Into an emptying out Buzz Lightyear section. Got a couple of clearance tags up. Some more of Jurassic Park. We have Hordak, Trap Joss, fourteen ninety nine. See, there's Hordak, sixteen forty nine. Actually, he's just in the wrong spot down there. And that's Shira, Beast Man, King Gray Skull. We have a little bit of an empty shelf here, but some Star Wars stuff. We have a bunch of Star Wars here on clearance, 1609, 1019, but it just depends if they're on the right pegs. Somebody tried to open up a Hordak and steal him. He's on clearance. Don't steal him. Come on, guys. Oh, there's the trap jaw. We, how lucky is that? He's behind me the whole time. Oh, I may have to pick him up. We'll see. Maybe he's on clearance too. I'll check his price. But I doubt it since he's a newer figure. So we have some wrestling here. Also on sale and clearance, it looks like. And then sort of empty at the bottom. So I will check the prices and I will put that up for you guys if anything has a good price or is at a good clearance just so you guys can have the knowledge maybe you can make it to the store and catch them too okay guys so checking all the figures that were on the clearance pegs it looks like it was only power ring that was on clearance for 1249 this guy here and the only other one that i found that was on clearance was the pink ranger ninja for 1324 so in case anybody wants those figures, head, head to your local Target and see if they have them in stock. Pick them up. Okay, so we're making our way here to the small little NECA section. And it looks like they bought some out. Some spawn up there with the McFarlane Dragon, Annabelle, a NECA, Michael Myers from Part 2. Here's a page puncher, green arrow. I'm waiting for this guy to go on clearance because I do want to pick him up. I prefer him with the hat. I can wait, I don't need to have him now. Flash Gordon, Strange Things. What's this back here? Is this Nightmare Spawn? Let's put him with Plague. I have some pops here. He looks cool. Silver. A few more pops. This is not as full as it usually is, but it is after the holidays. We have some Harry Potter here. Have a spawn in the back. This is the gunslinger. Some pins. More pops. This TMNT across Stranger Things is just everywhere I'm going, which is a good thing. I'm glad to see that they're making it available. Have some model kits, Boba Fett. Oh, Boba Fett ship. That'd be a cool model kit to do. Jurassic Park, Toonie Terrors, and just a few more. Pop with a shirt there. Another pop here, Wakanda Forever. Or pops and shirts, Miss Marvel there, or Captain Marvel, I mean, and this was some Godzilla, and I think Godzilla's going to finish out our hunt at this location. Last stop of 2022, we're coming into a Walmart, 
and we're finishing out the year here hopefully we get lucky i didn't end up picking the uh moon night up because my budget was just hit too hard this year so maybe we'll find some good clearance here at the end of the year see you inside so we're going to start off this hunt in the aisle and we are having some empty pegs here but this is a side that's not too important at least not to me because i don't collect too much from here halo five nights at freddy's we have some of the metal dinosaurs. We have some wrestling there. Locked Panther clearance for $29. Not too much of a price drop. Have some wrestling here. A lot of the same stuff that we've already seen many multiple times. Hopefully, you know, they're all going on clearance soon and Whoever wants to pick them up, picks them up. There's that guy still. Mo2. So, Bakugan. Oh. We have Ulick or Ulick. Moving on into the Power Rangers and some Star Wars. There's a mixture right here. This is different. First Walmart I've encountered that had a whole panel dedicated to Avatar. Wow, they're really loaded up. Let's continue down to the next aisle. They have a NECA Robocop. Okay. Star Trek. Some Star Wars they have a lot of overstock on the top there. If you guys are ever looking for something and it's not on the shelf, look in the overstock. I've gotten lucky a few times and I've been able to find some figures that weren't on the pegs. Okay, so we're here moving into some of the uh, DC multiverse have Superboy Prime, Penguin in the back over here, more Penguin and the Demon, is that Superman there, have another two legends here, some more play along, Transformers, Shelf full here. One lonely legend. More transformers. Into some GI Joes. Transformers and Star Wars with some stretchy men. Kind of looks like Shredder a little bit. We have a Jurassic Park, more stretchies, Gujitsus, some clearance Buzz Lightyear, Jurassic Park vehicle, more Jurassic Park. Let's go check out collectible section. Walking up to one of the little collectible spots bit of a mess but at least they have some stuff on the shelf especially those creepy af garbage pail kids have some jack skellington funny look at that these guys are creepier than this guy <laughs> put him back there we have some nest minis here in the collectibles collect them guys like them. Pocus Pocus. We have some blind bags here. Marvel ET statue. Batman. Let's 
some pops here more of the line ball collectibles a lot of the same here at the bottom and we have this big thing here suicide squad i believe this thing is like a hundred dollars or something like that but it is an awesome price for all of these figures me uh, the only one i would care to have would be king shark but not even that much so we'll leave that one there for somebody else who wants to pick it up let's make our way around the corner because there is an end cap of a bunch of pops of star wars et and a lot of Avengers here. All right, let's continue on to the next end cap. We have a few of those lamps. We have the Clark Griswold pop. He was on clearance at the other Walmart. Maybe the same thing here, but Walmart is the same way as Target, and they tend to have different prices at different locations. Bunch of backpacks there. We'll take a look at this other end cap. E.T., more Clark Griswolds, Larry Bird, Magic Johnson, Giant Pops there, Shira on the Swift Wind, Fly the Little Pony, we have Raish, E.T., flip right this way, we have some Migos here, Teen Wolf, Avatar, some Infinity Saga, Witcher, Aliens, Boba Fett, Kiss 4-Pack, Black Panther, Avatar, here's a McFarlane Dragon, Boba Fett, Taskmaster, it's a pretty cool action statue. If I was a statue collector, I'd pick that up. Wolfman, Mummy. We have a Wonder Woman. Here's a Bendy Fig Dracula. Superman. Batman Avatar. Just a little bit of different items here. More pops than anything. Gizmo. And we have pop sets of Queen. A lot of different other pops here. We are going to finish out our hunt here in the clearance section. Hopefully we find something good. But if not, it's okay. There's always next year. Have a bunch of sets here. Our kids, we have some learning dissected frogs and fish up there. The Mega Lab, got a catch. We have the little mermaids there. We have this big baby shark rider here. Encanto, Encanto. Play, make your own jewelry. Years. There's a Power Ranger here on clearance for $19. Four dollars on making some milkshake blaster and chocolate sprinkles. Skateboard. Blue. Lots there. There's a Motu Strider for 15 on clearance if you guys are looking for that one. Some Monopoly. bunch of uh, items here for the kids we have some more Power Rangers here on clearance we have the Wolf Ranger Red Fury Ranger and we have some of the cogs here all for $19 I don't know how much of a clearance that is but it's cheaper than original price right have some Legos on clearance as well. 
some Eternals. 40. Some Batman there with the police car. We have a bunch of the big items here too. Just going to flip around the corner here. Check out the rest of the clearance. So we have a few items. Not much at all. Nothing of it, too much interest. Some Batman selling a Kyle Barbie. That's at $5. For the kiddos. $7 buzz. Looks like somebody tried to take the Thor without paying. Have some more clearance items with some moon shoes kicking in at nineteen dollars an hour or nineteen dollars per set. And we have some Christmas vacation games, Buzz Lightyear, Power Rangers Dino Fury, seven dollars. Finishing strong on some Beast Wars Transformers. So I think that does it for this spot. Last hunt of the year. Hope everybody has a great new year. Remember to be safe. Don't drink and drive. And remember, enjoy the little things in life. Happy New Year to everybody. Till next year.